in the first match, Hajime Ohara versus Yasutakayano. We are live and direct on Wrestle Universe, sending you the best in hard hitting professional wrestling from the land of the rising sun. This is Pro Wrestling Noah. I'm Stuart Fulton, joined by Mark Pickering, and we are live at the Yokohama Budokan in Kanagawa, Japan. Big card today, Mark. Nine matches and three. GHC Championship titles on the line. Oh, absolutely, Stuart. It's a pleasure to be here alongside you. Yokohama Budokan, as you say, nine matches and three first-class title matches. And we are set to get right off into the action. Yes, Takayano is in the ring already, rearing to go, champing at the bit. This man is getting better day by day. Absolutely, Stuart. Putting on a lot of size as well, making some great developments, great progress. Young Yasutaki Yano, great test room today against Hajime Ohara. Two excellent Noah wrestlers to set off the action on this nine match card with three GHC titles on the line. This is set to be very fast paced, lots of Action from Hajime Ohara is already making his way out. He's a Kawasaki man, just a couple of stops down on the train from here. In Yokohama, we are just walking distance from Kanai Station. For a long time, Pankras Dojo was out here. But today, it's all Noah. It's all Wrestle Universe. It's all hard hitting action. Hajime Ohara is in the ring. 37 years of age. Always in top condition, Mark. Absolutely, he's a first class professional. Really, really well trained out in Mexico. Absolute student of the game. And a fantastic technician as well. Really great way to kick things off here in Yokohama. Certainly is. He made his debut in 2004, May of 2004, compared to Yastagoyano, who is 21 years of age. So 15 years, sorry, 16 years his junior made his debut in October of just last year. But wow, since that day at Koraku and Hall versus Kenya Okada, Yastagoyano has come on leaps and bounds. He makes his 83rd professional wrestling appearance here today. And of course, I'm gonna have to say this again, Mark, he pinned Nosawa Ronga in the performance of his career so far on the first anniversary of his debut. Absolutely, Stuart, October 28th, we was there in Kumamoto. Absolutely fantastic achievement for that young man. A really testament to the progress he's made just 12 months into his career, still only 21 years old. Let's see how he quits himself today against O'Hara. You know what, I replayed that moment in my head over and over again, and I realized that when he got the pin and the bell rang, I actually threw my pen, I sent my pen flying. Yeah, we <laughs> I bounced it off the table and the two of us are jumping around. Yeah, I was just so pleased with him. You know, we've seen how hard he works in the dojo, how hard he works in the ring, and it's all paying off for him. It certainly is. Now, these two meet today for the fourth time, but it's been nine months since their last singles match, and. The rookie Yano has come on so well. Ohara's job in this match today is to teach Yano in the only way he knows how, with impressive professional wrestling skills. And already you're seeing beautiful control and poise from Hajime Ohara. Oh, beautiful arm drag there from Yano. Fantastic exchanges off the bat. There's the drop kick from Yano, making it look easy. That arm drag is really tremendous. Full rotation on there. Picture perfect. He's got good control of the left arm of Ohio. Look at the knee over the face there. Just perfect control keeping the posture down, but of course, Hajime Ohara knows how to move, knows how to get out of these positions. Yano 
is out here today to show just how much he has and maybe see some new tools coming out of the tool bag from the rookie Yano. Absolutely. Absolutely. And O'Hara, of course, he's such a great Mac technician. He's based in his Lucha Libre upbringing, started his career out there in Mexico. And the former full throttle leader. He's going to ask a lot of questions here, Viano. O'Hara, a former four time GMC junior heavyweight tag team champion, alongside Dice Dice Harada. After they won it from Stinger. <laughs> also a former GHC Junior Heavyweight Champion, which he held for 140 days back in 2017, made two successful title defenses. And there we already see the experience and control of O'Hara. Yeah, they simply no escape from that submission attempt. That's called La Navarro Special. O'Hara calls that after Negro Navarro, innovative Mexican Mac expert. Pumped in a very sharp elbow draw into the lower back of Yano there, hooks up the leg. If it's one thing Yano's been doing for the last couple of years, it's been escaping. Yeah, he's had to do a lot over the last 12 months. And as we talk about the progress he's made over this time over this last year, you have to wonder, as we've commented on before, whether some of these junior heavyweight groups will try to recruit Yano. Yeah, that's something very interesting to keep your eyes on because he is clearly a future star and in such a short space of time. And even comparing him to his generational rival, Kai Fujimura, he's arguably got a brighter future at this moment in time. Yeah, he's a real star at Yano, and the crowd's getting right behind him here, and they need to. Fire with a cover. Yano kicks out, not once, but twice. There's the third, he's still under O'Hara there. Oh, he's out. Love the persistence there from O'Hara. But Yano was equal to it, more credit to him. Excellent hustle from Yastaka Yano. And the crowd here already getting behind them in this first match. Beautiful, cool, clear, sunny day in Kanagawa, Japan. Crossbody there from Yano. And the drop kick again sends O'Hara over. Five minutes in, delivers him off the ropes. Bigger drop kick this time from Yano. Hooks up the leg, but to no avail. Shoulders up out of there, Hajime O'Hara. This is a really good spell for the youngster now. There can't be any let up now. Has to build on this. Kicks out of that one. Eats an elbow. Down to one knee. Yano surely not done. Out the back door. First elbow from O'Hara into the corner, but just sits down out of that one. Nobody home there for O'Hara up onto the top rope. Yastaka Yano. Oh, the body splash from the rafters. Fisherman. Oh, look at that. He wants to back up. Wrist control. Oh, there's the backbreaker. That's two very painful attacks to the lower back of Yano by Hajime O'Hara. That could well limit his offense now, Yano. O'Hara wants to finish this one in our opener. Oh, the shoulder's trying to kick out, manages to somehow get out of there, rolls him up. This is clever work from Yano. Really close there with the sunset flip. Oh, here we go. Sweet. This first match of the day is living up to the expectations. Elbows. He's up in the intensity now, but back comes O'Hara. 
on to the back breaker once more. That one has to have done it. Hooks up the leg, firmly on top there, but just a two count on that one. I'm afraid the damage could be done though, those three back breakers. That's really going to limit Yano now. Oh, nice Russian leg sweep. Thunders Yano down. Oh, now he's got him. Yeah, on the Tresslers. Classic O'Hara on the Tres. Fleur here, nowhere near the ropes. Just like Yano not tapping out so far. He's got nowhere to go, though. Oh, there he is, he's had to give up. And I do not blame him, that looked awful. Yeah, he was in a really bad shape there, really bad state. Great work, as always, from O'Hara. He softened up Yano with those backbreakers and then followed up with the Tres Fleurs then. Really strong performance from that man, former full throttle leader, Jimmy O'Hara. Non-stop action from the first bell to the last on that one, Hajime O'Hara. Yeah, that's Dominant. What, that's what the junior heavyweight division is all about. And he is one of our standard bearers, Hajime O'Hara. Yano still down, still in trouble. Nobody coming to help him. Kai Fujimura's looking on, but doing nothing so far. The man of the hour, however, is Hajime O'Hara. Big congratulations. Finally back on his feet. Yes, Takayano makes his way out. Stay with us, folks. Coming up next, a singles match. Yohei versus Tadasuke. What a young warrior he is. That's Takayano, ladies and gentlemen. The most jaw-dropping, revered, first-rate action. Pro Wrestling Noah. 900 yen monthly. Watch all the action you want on Wrestle Universe. State of the art, powerful production and drama of biblical proportions. The highest level athletes and techniques collide with our shining stars. Do not miss the finest in pro wrestling right now Wrestle Universe.